Ah, space. The final frontier. And the crown jewel of it all, the moon. Taunting man in the sky with his cheesy goodness, long as he desired to go and stand on it and devour it. But many of our efforts have failed to get to the moon, and we don't have rockets in Minecraft. So, sigh. Tell you what, let's go anyway. Here's some basic facts we need to know first. The Earth and the Moon are in orbit. Well, the Moon orbits at a minimum distance of 362,570 kilometers. That's that many meters. We don't know what this is for Minecraft and its moon, but we can kind of act upon the assumption it's something similar. Okay, that out of the way. How do we get there? Well, we could always pillar up, besides the fact that this would take forever, and, well, there's a height limit in Minecraft anyway. This leaves us with one alternative, the humble TNT cannon. Long has everyone known that using TNT and water you can avoid damage and blast off into the air. Uh, so let's try this one out and see how far it gets us. Yes, let's go up. Yeah, not very far at all. Um, we're going to need something a bit bigger. Um, something like this. This is a cannon, which I've designed for the purpose of testing how much TNT we will need to get to the moon. Well, the way this works is that the command block here teleports me to the exact center to avoid any individual deviation to the side. Then TNT sets off and propels me. I change the amount of TNT in each dispenser and which ones would active uh, in order to plot a graph of results. I repeated each test five times. Furthermore, I took the time to factor in any human error and did all my calculations twice. So there you go. From testing, I found that there is a relationship between the distance you go and the TNT you use. But the main question is, how much TNT would get you to the moon? Well, I found it is... Um, 15 million seven hundred sixty three thousand nine hundred and thirteen TNT yeah well it looks like the end is going to be as close as we're going to get to the moon for now unless somebody can realistically come up with a way of packing that much TNT into one space well that's all from me see you later